Well, this weekend is seeing senior royals visiting all four UK nations. This morning, crowds in Belfast greeted the Earl and Countess of Wessex with a very warm welcome. Prince Edward and Sophie are visiting Northern Ireland as part of the Queen's Platinum Jubilee celebrations. Well, joining me now is our senior island correspondent, David Blevins. Uh, and David, just remind us where you are and what's been going on there today. Yes, Jane, welcome back to Bangor in County Down, where there is a terrific celebration going on to mark the Platinum Jubilee. Vehicles from all seven decades, vintage fairground attractions and music and dancing to take us all back in time. Now, this was the second of two engagements for the royal couple today. First of all, they went to Belfast City Centre, appropriately arriving in Royal Avenue in front of City Hall, where they were able to partake in a very multicultural celebration. There was all sorts of Belfast busking bands, a Chinese dragon dance and some music from a band consisting of Irish, Indian, African and Polish musicians. So a truly multicultural affair. And then they made their way over here to Bangor on the North Down coast, not just to mark 70 years of Queen Elizabeth, but also the fact that this town has just been designated city status. They seemed very relaxed, despite the obvious security that has to surround this kind of event in Northern Ireland. I stopped to chat to many people in the crowd. I asked His Royal Highness if he was glad to be back in Northern Ireland. He replied, yes, and thank you for the weather, which I think suggests, as is often the case, it wasn't quite so sunny on the last visit he made to Northern Ireland. But there has been a very warm welcome uh, for Edward and Sophie in both Belfast and Bangor as Northern Ireland plays its part in marking this Platinum Jubilee this weekend.